The Sparkly Star, A Christmas Story It's time to put up the Christmas tree, Grandma said. My favorite day of the year, Alfie replied. Grandma got out a long green box. Inside the box was the Christmas tree. Alfie got out three silver boxes. Inside the boxes were the Christmas decorations. While Grandma strung the colorful lights, Alfie hung the ornaments. They had striped candy canes, jolly snowmen, and dancing elves. Don't forget my favorite one, Grandma said, as she handed Alfie a sparkly star. Alfie placed the star on top of the tree. It's perfect, Grandma said, admiring the colorful Christmas tree. Why do we have a fake tree, he asked. It's from my childhood, his grandmother explained. Why do we have a star instead of an angel for the top of the tree? That was a gift from your grandpa on our very first Christmas together. That night, Alfie looked at the stars and made a secret Christmas wish. One day, I hope we have a real Christmas tree. The next morning, Grandma and Alfie woke up to a loud bang. The Christmas tree was on the floor. Branches and decorations were everywhere. Oh no, what happened? Alfie asked. I guess this tree is just too old, Grandma said. Just then, two big black eyes peered out from the tree. A squirrel, Grandma shouted. Alfie opened the door and the squirrel ran outside. I have an idea, Grandma said. Let's decorate a real tree for Christmas. They both went outside with the decorations. While Grandma strung the lights, Alfie hung the ornaments. It's perfect, Alfie said, admiring their real Christmas tree. Grandma stood back. It's missing something, she said, and they both knew what it was. Alfie ran inside. He looked everywhere for the sparkly star, but it was nowhere to be found. I'm sorry, Grandma, he said. I know it was your favorite. You're my favorite, she said. Merry Christmas.